as a human being, you grow out of this physical universe in just exactly the same way that an apple grows off an apple tree. So let's say the tree which grows apples is a tree which apples, using apple as a verb. And a world in which human beings arrive is a world that peoples. And so the existence of people is symptomatic of the kind of universe we live in. Just as hair on a head is symptomatic of what's going on in the organism. But we have been brought up not to feel that we belong in the world. So our popular speech reflects it. We say, I came into this world. You didn't, you came out of it. We say, face facts. We talk about encounters with reality. As if it was a head-on meeting of completely alien agencies. And the average person has the sensation that he is a somewhat that exists inside a bag of skin, the center of consciousness, which looks out at this thing and what the hell is it going to do to me? Uh, I recognize you. You kind of look like me. And uh, I've seen myself in a mirror. And uh, y you look like you might be people. <laughs> so maybe you're intelligent. Maybe you can love, too. And uh, may perhaps you're all right. Some of you are, anyway. You've got the right color of skin, or you have the right religion, or whatever it is, you're OK. But there are all those people over in Asia and Africa. And they may not really be people. When you want to destroy someone, you always define them as unpeople.